Have you ever heard of a dripolator? Well, I just got this Corningware coffee and tea kettle, so let's make coffee the 1950s way. My mother uses Corningware dishes, so naturally I had to collect some for myself. The newest addition to my collection is this combination coffee and teapot. Once you set the water to heat up, you add some coffee to the canister and attach it to the glass dripolator. Once your water has reached the correct temperature, then you add it to the glass dripolator, which was made by Pyrex. Then you set it back on top of the pot and then remove the plunger from the center so that way the water drips down back into the coffee pot. While the coffee is on the stove, I take the time to make breakfast and I make enough coffee for both me and my husband. Then I set the pot back on the eye and it keeps it hot for the rest of the morning. Did you know that this teapot also made coffee?